It's Christmas in November at the Langevier household, new HomePod minis. So we've had the white ones and the space gray ones for some time. We got the new colors, one of each here, uh, and I'm excited to, to check them out. So we're gonna unbox them and uh, see what they're all about. Let's get started. What up everybody, it's George Langbeer with Silver Hammer Surveillance. Here on the channel we talk tech and we talk security. Today we're talking tech, we're talking Apple, one of my favorite subjects. Like I said, it's Christmas in November because I've been very excited to try out these new colors. This is a HomeKit Home, and I don't care what anybody says, HomeKit is just drastically underrated. I mean, I tried Google Home, I've got Google Home at my shop. Uh, I sell Nest products, as you've seen in all our videos. I've tried A-L-E-X-A -E and I can't stand it. So I'm an Apple guy, but man, HomeKit, I don't know what people's problem with it. I don't know if they're just plants that are just have to trash it for no reason, but HomeKit is fantastic and I, I don't care what anybody says. I put it up against any of the other platforms. It's fantastic. And when you're talking about HomeKit, there's no better way to control your HomeKit home than a HomePod mini. So. It's very exciting that they've got these new colors and uh, we're going to unbox them and check them out. Come on, give HomeKit some credit. Well, let's get started. All right, I'm not sure which color this is. We're going to try them all out. Unfortunately, robbed me of using my knife so far, but no, I think I'm going to here. Even the box is pretty. What do you think, Teresa? I think it looks pretty cool. I'm excited to see it out of the box. Pretty yellow. Not usually a yellow guy, but this is uh, pretty cool. All right. So we got the HomePod Mini. We got the picture of the HomePod. So was my math correct that you, there will be five colors? Five available? colors total now? Yep. Yes. You know, we got space gray, we got white, we got this yellow, we got an orange, and we got a blue. Okay. So, we got the HomePod Mini itself, we got the usual um, Apple packaging here. But this is cool because the braided cable, it's kind of like the uh, iMac, um, very similar to the colors. So that's pretty cool. And then we've got the yellow HomePod, white top, but the volume buttons are yellow as well. And then when you take your label off, you got the yellow Apple logo. And then you've got your charging brick and then your documentation. So, just like the other HomePods, but uh, cool new colors. All right, let's move on. Yeah, yellow's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. It's kind of a dark yellow, a little more manly uh, than your typical yellow. And uh, I try to be a man, but uh, I don't know. Man. It's more golden yellow. It is golden yellow. Very, very good uh, description. All right. That was yellow. Let's see what else we got. All right. So we got the blue one. The box itself, it's cool navy blue. The uh, mini graphic looks pretty, pretty sweet on this one. Ooh, that's pretty cool. It's almost a silver hammer blue. It is the color of our logo, but uh, yeah, it's not a an obnoxious bright blue. It's more of a uh, monochrome blue. Yeah, so it sticks with the, the colors of the um, AirPods Max and the iMac. And then again, with the braided cable, we got that same accent color that those have. So it's very cool. I was wondering about the cable. I didn't know uh, what they do with that, but uh, very nice braided. But that, that cool accent color, like I said, kind of sticks with the, uh, the theme of the new uh, Mac and uh, AirPods Max and such. So again, white on the top, 
It's got the blue volume buttons and Apple logo. And obviously nothing different here. Got the charging brick and the documentation. All right. Last but not least, orange. So again, this kind of all started with the, um, the iPad Air, I guess, as far as the colors, the new colors go. And then uh, got the AirPods Max, and then again the Mac. So nice to see that Apple's branching out in the color realm. But uh, it's kind of a very dark orange. You say kind of a modern orange. See the mini graphics are cool. I know in my uh, shop, I'm kind of excited to just have these boxes as a display because they just look cool. Because at Silver Hammer, we do sell these little bad boys. Then when you get into it, it's a little lighter, um, but that's a really cool color. I would call these colors mid-century modern yeah. colors for sure. Especially this, yeah, I would say so. And this orange in particular uh, is very mid-century modern. Uh, the braided cable. A little right, more let me get up close to pink. the braiding and see if you can like really see it. So yeah, the cable again. Um, they do have a white tip, but, uh, but yeah, again, white top with the uh, color matching volume buttons, and then the Apple logo on the bottom. Hmm. Pretty sweet. And then in all of them, the charging brick is white. So yeah, HomePod Mini is great for controlling your HomeKit home. It's a Thread device. Go back and check out our um, video on Thread. But uh, these kind of you know act as a, uh, a Thread device. And uh, but yeah, it controls everything in your home. They sound great for a little speaker. They are, Apple just came out with the new voice plan for $4.99. So that's a little different than Apple Music in that you just control everything with your voice. You don't have quite the access you do with uh, Apple Music, um, the family plan and the individual plan. Like you don't get the uh, spatial audio and the lossless audio, but um, basically you get all their Apple Music stations, all their uh, curated playlists. Um, at $4.99, it's a pretty good deal. And uh, you can use that on the um, phone, your um, AirPods and your HomePod Mini. But uh, here uh, in our smart home, we basically use this to control everything in here. And so, uh, again, very exciting to have some new color options. But uh, give HomeKit a chance, especially if you're an Apple person. The Home app is built into your phone. If you don't know what that is, it's your smart home. And uh, you just need maybe an Apple TV or uh, an iPad you can leave at home or one of these guys to control it, but there's a ton of HomeKit devices. Uh, check out our videos on Matter. Matter is coming in 2022. It's going to even make the uh, HomeKit even broader with uh, combining different things that you couldn't use with HomeKit before. Uh, check out our video on the Starling Hub. You know, I'm a big Nest guy. Go back and check out our videos on the Nest products. Starling Hub can put your uh, Nest products into HomeKit and then control it all with these. Um, they sound great together. You can put them in stereo pair. Um, they're fantastic for, for the size. And uh, again, I put this up against Google Home speakers or ALEXA speakers. Um, they're fantastic. So again, hopefully you enjoyed the unboxing. Go out and buy the color, put in the comments um, what you bought, if you bought one. Again, this is release day and uh, Big Apple Nerd and uh, it's always like Christmas on these days. Right, Teresa? Yes, Langabeer Christmas with electronics. Yes. It's always a good day. Especially Apple. All right, well, hopefully you liked the video. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe to the channel, please. We enjoy your support. We love having you here. And until the next video, peace and love.